Hello everyone, this is Alex, the driving instructor from Sensen Driving School. In today's video, we'll be talking about how to deal with speed bumps. Before we get started with the video, generally I get booked up at least two months in advance. Yes, that's weekdays and weekends. So please reach out to me as early as possible if you would like lessons from me. The best way to contact me is through text and I will reply as soon as I can. I will always give priority bookings to students who are subscribers to this channel. Thank you. You can expect speed bumps or speed humps in and around anywhere that requires you to slow down. Great examples include but not limited to playground zones, school zones, alleyways, or parking lots. just in case anyone doesn't know what I'm referring to when I'm talking about speed bumps. This is an example of a sign that warns you there are bumps ahead. Because the speed limit is in yellow, it means they recommend you slow to 30 km per hour for the bumps. More often than not, the previous sign will be posted nearby a playground zone. or a school zone. Alright, let's see me drive over some speed bumps and tell you what speed I usually recommend my students go. Note, it's actually a little slower than recommended. Okay, just making a standard right turn here, two shoulder checks. Okay, so we just entered a playground zone. Did you catch the bumps ahead sign right after the right turn? If you didn't, roll back the video and have a look. That was the first speed bump we just went through. There's the second one. So we just went over two speed bumps while we were in the playground zone. I know the sign says 30 km per hour, but I always recommend students go 20 or below and 15 is ideal. So slow down to 20 just before you hit the speed bump and as you go over it, the car will slow down to 15 km per hour. Don't just stay at 20 km per hour the whole way. Make sure to bring your speed back up to 25 to 30 between the speed bumps. Otherwise, you're going too slow. Okay, another example going through a school zone. There's the sign warning us again. So here we enter the school zone. Let's see how many speed bumps we go over during this clip. And you'll see me go down to 20 just before the speed bump. There we go. That was the first one. Okay, you see me slow down to 20. Going over the second one there. Looks like there were another two that I went over. Okay, so uh, review here. Expect speed bumps or humps in areas where you're supposed to go slower. I recommend hitting them at 20 or below and 15 is ideal. Of course, keep an eye out for signs. They will warn you they are up ahead. Okay, that's it for now. Please subscribe, like this video and comment below and let me know what you would like to see more from this channel. Thank you. Bye now.